Central Michigan kind of took a chance on me and I came to camp here and both Jerry and Christine both kind of expressed that they developed their athletes into better athletes, like who they were when they were freshmen versus who they walked out as, as seniors, um, their skill level increased. It wasn't just the skill level that they were looking at, it was also the personal development that you were going to graduate a leader. Leading by example is everything within leadership and making sure that when you're in the gym, you're all in the gym. When you're in school, you're, you're in school. You're not um, distracted by anything. And the examples that you're setting, not just in the gym, but everywhere, they're just as important as in the gym. So. Here she goes for the double pike. Very strong landing for Katie Clements. Impressive, as always, from the senior. Katie really epitomizes the concept of being a student athlete. And when Katie is around, everyone is attentive to what Katie says and how she does things. And when you look at that from outside of the program, she has just matured into one of the finest young ladies that I've ever coached. Katie has all of these qualities and so many more. She just exudes everything that is a leader. And like I said, she is able to just build up this team like no other. And she loves this sport and is truly passionate for the sport and this team and all the girls on the team. She knows what has to be done. She's proven that in every meet so far this year. She's come through in situations when a quarter tenth meant a great deal. And she's one of the athletes that I trust to pay attention to the scoreboard. And she knows exactly where we're at. And really very few athletes can handle that kind of pressure. So her legacy is going to be huge. She's currently ranked third in the nation on balance beam. Uh, she will definitely be an All-American for Central Michigan. and. Uh, I think that legacy speaks for itself. My advice to underclassmen would be to love the story that they're telling. If you don't love the story that you're telling, you have the opportunity to change it at any time, at any place, at any moment. And you want to be able to tell your four-year student-athlete story with such pride and being proud to be a Chippewa. And, you know, you want to be able to yell it out the window and if you don't love it, work hard. Nobody can beat hard work. Nobody can beat somebody who never quit. You know, be relentless to chase that story that you have been dreaming to tell your whole life.